Hey guys, it's Shane. Uh, this topic is about my name. Um, my full name is Shane Riley Ivany. Um, well, it's Shane Riley Sora Ivany, but I usually keep Sora out because it's part of a video game and that was just something I put in for myself. Uh, I named myself completely. Um, Shane came about uh, when I was 16. So a couple of friends and I used to get together and write stories, and I just decided to keep that. Because um, even my brother used to introduce me to his friends as Shane back then. Um, it also means God is gracious. Uh, I'm not a believer of God, but I'm a believer. I'm a very spiritual person. I believe that there is a higher power. And I believe that with my skills and my gifts, I believe that God is gracious and that, sorry, I make sure I stay on track. Um, and so that's my belief is that I'm here and he's gracious that I'm still here. Um, Riley is something about water and how it's free flowing. Flowing stream. Flowing stream, hear that? <laughs> she knows better than I do because I can't remember. Um, and for me, that means freedom. So I, I really, I really like that name. Actually, I like that name more than Shane. Um, but everyone just called me Shane because it was easier. Um, and again, Sora is there because uh, Kingdom Hearts is a video game. As I grew up, it was something I could play, and it's an RPG that I could just get away and play and just be this character so I put that in there for myself and my last name is Ivany I don't know where my family is from I know I can only trace back to my great grandfather here in Newfoundland but Shane Riley and Ivany I kept it so it would flow because my previous birth name flowed very very well uh, but it was also very feminine to the point that I could not change it in any way to make it not feminine. So I kept a Y in each of my names, and that's why Shane has a Y in it, is because I, I like the idea of it flowing and there being a Y and everything. Um, I do love my name. Uh, again, I like Riley better than Shane. Um, if I could change my name to anything, I don't know if I would change it anymore. Uh, I originally was thinking about changing my last name because I don't associate with my family and I don't want to be associated with them, but it, I would be taking part of my history away. Um, so I just kept it there. Yep, I think that's about it about my name. Um, I really don't know how I came up with Riley. It was just stuck in my head for the longest time. And what I, when I read what it meant, I was very happy. And I went on UrbanDictionary.com to see what each name meant versus my old name. And it was actually really funny, the traits that came out on Urban Dictionary. So it was pretty accurate for both names. Um, anything else to add there, Candace? What is Pearlie's name, Riley? <laughs> oh, my cat, too. Um, I got him from the SPCA, and they told me originally his name was Farley. Um, and they made a mistake. His name was actually Riley. So, my cat and I have the same name. But I still call him Farley, because that's a cooler name than Riley. For him for him <laughs> and every time people say Riley they think of a dog which is kind of funny um, but it's also a very unisex name and here in North America Shane is a very masculine name unless you think of the L word and that is the one thing I want to stay away from with the name Shane is that everybody who says Shane they're like Oh, like from the L word. And I'm like, no, not from the L word. <laughs> no. Um, 
it's just a name that suited me and it stuck with me and it resounded with me and uh, I follow my instincts with things and that was my instinct to keep that name and since no one in my family had any of those names um, I just kept it and yeah that's it anyways peace love support and happiness and I will see you in three days if I get my video in on time and uh, that video will be about fears so that'll be a very interesting topic and uh, I'll see you then. Bye.